Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. It is time now for Design Time, and we are here in Auburn at Tri-City Furniture with Kathy Kilborn. Good so good morning. to see you in person, Kathy. Good to see you. It's been great. It has been, yes. Finally, good to see you again. We are talking today about, it's so important to, so many people have back problems, okay, to maintain your back pillows. We're talking about back pillow maintenance. What is that? Why is that important? Yes, I was at a home measuring and I looked at her sofa and yeah. it was very nice except for the back pillows were all compressed. And so I took a minute and said, we really need to fluff your back pillows and bring them back to life mm -hmm. because they had gotten compressed down. And many times that's because of pets sitting oh. on the top right. and they're compressing that cushion down so there really is a little bit of maintenance to this back pillow yeah. and it's pretty easy to do to maintain the look of your sofa as well as the comfort. Okay, Kathy, you know you have to show us. Get your hands in there. Let us okay. know how to do it. So <laughs> most pillows, whether it's big or small, most pillows are going to have a zipper and then they're going to have a pillow inside. So you can pull that out. And I've got a couple here that, you know, show the zipper. Um, but what you're going to do, and you can open it and actually get into that Dacron bag. But even if you just are going to use the pillow, you just want to pull it apart and fluff that back up. If you open it, you can actually get in there and pull the Dacron and it will actually get that loft back mm. and fill that cushion instead of being so compressed down. Yeah. Now, Kathy, so are all cushions made that you can do this, that you can do the fluffing with the back pillow? Pretty much. Okay. So you're going to find different fills okay. in the back pillows. So sometimes you're going to open this and you're just going to see Dacron in there. Those are the ones that are going to compress the most. The best ones are going to be when they're in another bag and that keeps them in place. The best ones are like this where they're actually what we call channel back. And so they're stitching in the pillow itself so when the Dacron is put in there, it stays in this part at the top and doesn't fall down to the bottom. So the cushions that are just one big bag are probably going to need that fluffing more often. And you really don't need more Dacron. You just need to pull it and get it fluffed back up oh. because you've compressed it from right. leaning or sleeping on it and it's compressed down. I, I really didn't know that you can actually get in there and do it yourself, that's great. Yes. So, tell us, so is there a, one back pillow or cushion that's better than another? Well, before we had yeah imports, these back pillows were actually foam cushions and they were much like what the seat cushion is here, an actual piece of foam. Those back pillows did not lose their shape at all. Again, we wanted to cut costs. Dacron is a less expensive product than a piece of foam. So the back pillows became more of a pillow and we need to fluff it. So a lot of times people will say, well, I never used to have to do this with my old sofa. Well, that was the difference. A pillow now is soft and squishy. It feels great, but it is going to need some fluffing. And so the variable there mm -hmm. is, and we still can get foam core backs that will keep a perfect shape. They will be firmer, but they hold their shape forever and you don't need to fluff them. If you have a softer back like these pillows, right. then you're going to have to fluff them. And they're not difficult. It's just you need to do it every once in a while. How often would you say it? I would say it's according to how you use it. Okay. So some people think this is a bed. Right. You're probably going to have to do it more often. If you're using it as a sofa and you're actually pushing against the pillow backwards like you're supposed to, you probably don't have to do it as often. But if it gets compressed downward, you're going to need to fluff it to push it back up into that pillow shape. Okay. 
Okay, so you'll know when it's time to fluff that pillow. Yes, unzip okay. it. Some people yeah. didn't even know you could get inside of these cushions. Right. Whether it's attached, this yeah. one's attached, but that zipper is still there. You need to pull this bag out, fluff it up, and then put it back in. And you'll be amazed it will make your sofa look new again. So really get to know your sofa, unzip it, and start fluffing. Thank you, Kathy. Thank you. We really appreciate you joining us. Thank you for watching this edition of Design Time.